engineer creates AI Jesus which goes on to make terrifying apocalyptic prophecy. It was designed by engineer George Davila Durandal and told to write about just three topics, the plague, Roman Emperor Caesar and the end of days. The artificial intelligence has so far produced 60,000 words. An engineer has created a so-called AI Jesus that has poured over the Bible and produced its own bizarre verses. It developed its vocabulary by reading the holy text and no other literature. The AI aims to reproduce the tone of the King James Bible without copying it word for word. It was told to write about just three topics, the plague, Caesar and the end of days, by creator George Davila Durandal. Approximately 60,000 words have been produced by the program as of August 26. Some of the work is nonsensical, but eerily echoes the style of biblical scripture. One section, originally posted on Medium, reads, The plague shall be the fathers in the world, and the same is my people, that he may be more abundant in the mouth of the Lord of hosts. For the tabernacle of the Lord shall be known by the works of the Lord, which proclaim I am against this city, according as he hath sent me to the marriage of the Spirit. For I will fill the land which the Lord thy God hath given thee a time to eat the force of the Lord of hosts. The end of days states, And he that was dead, the servant of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, speak unto you all that dwell in the wilderness and they shall be saved by the border of the Lord and his priests and his sons, and on the seven lambs, and of the seven places of the beast, and the other on the Sabbath days. The last section was devoted to Roman Emperor Caesar. It reads, The scribes and the children of Israel were gathered together with the Levites and the men of Bethsemesh, which was the son of Josiah king of Judah, and they hanged them through the head of the body of Christ, and hath sent me. Discussing his creation, Mr. Durandal said, Whether or not God created man or man created God might be a topic of eternal debate. But what surely cannot 